Hey, what is going on, everybody? Scott Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're back. We're playing some more Cyberpunk. Um, we've just escaped this camp. I wonder why they do this with their legs. I wonder if it's ideal for me to chop off. Is that why? It's not. Um, I don't know why I wondered why a corpse is doing something with their legs. Anyway, um, we're back. We, we've we just escaped the, uh, the scav hideout. Uh, what I've done in the meantime is... I've done some crafting, so we have uh, have we have upgraded our sniper rifle and our um, and our, uh, our sword. What's interesting is I wasn't really paying attention. And upgrading our sniper rifle, I believe, means that our sorry, our sword now does less damage, which is interesting. Now we've also lost some mods because I didn't have the thing that disengages mods. So we'll go and buy some in in the future. What I'm going to do is, if we just go into crafting and have a look here, so you can see to craft these we need rare components, we need uh, epic components. You can see now that we need one of two because we brought a perk that allows us to, to create these cheaper. And over here you can see we can re create legendary crafting components by using these. Um, I think what we're going to do though is I'm going to set up a macro um, when I'm not playing to, to convert scrap into common components and then eventually create uh, rare components because otherwise just to give you an idea of what this means I have to sit here and hold the button like this so I think I'll probably just set something up to to do that while I'm AFK for a bit just to, to get us into a place where we're using our scrap otherwise we'll, we'll never ever use it what I did do is uh, create some uh, some of these some um, some inner flame flame resistant rocker jacks um, I didn't mean to I accidentally uh, I accidentally created them when I thought I was creating components. Um, but we can go and sell these. And as you can see, you get 578k. But also, we're going to head off to uh, to find Stefan. And we'll kick his ass. I'd like to find uh, something to... Uh, ouchie! To, to sell these items as we go. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll stumble across somewhere. You're in trouble. You're in trouble, Stefan, by the way. That was fun. Uh, that was that was interesting. I mean, we knew it could have been a con, right? But I quite enjoyed the fact that it was a con and that we had to to fight our way out there. A little bit tough. Um, turns out all of our stuff was stashed in that main room. Um, but I'm I'm gonna guess people could have left there without without finding it. Um, we had to go to the mission to to track it down, right? Um Okay. Be nice if there was a drop point nearby somewhere, right? We're heading this way. Is there a drop point on the way? Yeah, there is, sort of. Okay. Let's keep going. I do enjoy the jumping now we've got it. Um, we should probably, once we've got some cash, head to a ripper dock and just see what the... Uh, customizations we we can make additionally just if i go back to our crafting over here you can see we're crafting 11 uh, if we go back to our character and into this crafting menu you can see down here the other you know the, the benefits of being higher level so if we get to level 12 uh, there's a chance a five percent chance we might acquire components when we're uh, when we're making stuff but here unlocks crafting specs for epics weapons combat gadgets and cyberware so the more we do of this the uh, the more chance we have of of making things and you get xp from making components so it could be by doing this we're going to end up with a a reasonable amount of of stuff in the bank whoa running downhill we were extra quick then um are we anywhere near this we're heading to it okay let's just set this oh no let's just set this here well, it looks like we're going to run past it anyway but Let's get going. I mean, we could have got the car out, but we do like a, a nice little stroll every now and then. I also like that I can leap over roads. Okay. Is 
through these guys. So we did get some uh, some new tech, I think. So, oh no, this is the one. Look. So if we, who are these guys? These are racketeers. Let's just let's just have a little peek around this corner. So we've set off detonate grenade. That was pretty impressive, right? I don't know where we found that. I don't know how long we've had it. But I like that a lot. I guess we won't ever know what kind of grenade they've got. It's going to be less effective if they have like a flashbang. But you know, I suppose if they've got a flashbang, it'll give us the chance to... Uh, to react. These guys don't seem to be that interested. Okay. So we do have a huge chance of critting now as well on our weapon. I did. I'm the best. Um, oh, hello. So yeah, if we just quickly jump back into our weapon. I'll stop talking about it now, but... I don't know how much it was before, but we've now got a 60% uh, chance to crit and plus 77% crit damage. Um, I'd like to get some mods that increase those if I can. Well, look, we've just got something that I think we might have a copy of this before, but um, essentially will allow us to... Uh, Instead of having our oper current operating system, it will boost our crit chance as well. I like that. I like this. I like this. This dude was reaching over, stealing money. And essentially, we've just chopped off his head and left him here. I like that a lot. And right now, we need all the euro dollars we can get, right? Okay, let's, let's come in here. So we want to sell. Let's sell some of this crap first of all. Um, I'd like to increase, improve this as well, our Lizzie. Uh, but for now, let's uh, let's go in here. We've got this to sell, plain old katana, and then we've got these. How much are we managing to sell them for? It does look like we're getting the the five hundred, right? Look at this. Is this the, the Joker, right? This is essentially the Joker outfit. I'm, I'm inclined to put it on. Uh, we'll keep hold of that for now. So most of these things are better than what we've got on. But they don't... Um, They don't have the mod slots. Okay, we got 13k. That's quite nice. Where am I meant to be going? Coming for you, Stefan. Little does he know. I bet his mates didn't even warn him because they're all dead. That I'm on my way. I'd like a refund. Hey, holy shit, Jube. You good? After you booted up that virtue, you started glitching out and... Save your breath. You conned me. You knew what you were doing. You want to know what I do, though? Hmm? 
Now hold up, yo. Let's all be chill for a second. You've got one hour to get out of Night City and never look back. Oh, oh, my sweet fucking Jesus. Thank you. I knew you could. Shut the fuck up. I wasn't finished. If I ever see your face again, I'll gut you and string you up by your insides. Understand? Now start walking. I mean, that is what it is, I guess, right? We lost lots of money. I mean, we made most of it back fairly quickly by crafting. I guess that's the plus point of taking the crafting path, right? You wouldn't normally do it, um, but you can you can make some, some pretty good money out of it. So, you know, in a game like this, loot is, loot is fairly rapid, right? Doesn't really make a huge amount of odds to be crafting. Um... Especially since I've crafted a sword that's not as good as my last sword. Okay, we are going to go to the ramen shop this time, though. We were right there before. I'm ready. You're ready? I'm ready. Hey. Could go for a bite. I figured. What can I get you? Um, we don't really care. Maybe not some pop turd. Will you sit? I will sit. Thank you for coming. Cozy little joint. Doesn't really match your style though. Yeah, who are these dudes? But it's perfect for a one on one. Is it? Here we are then. What is it? I. I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. It wasn't that long ago since we last met. Something happened since then? No. I mean, something did happen, though not recently. Okay. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell you. Where to even start? Relax. No need to rush. <sighs> uh, uh, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. His personality... He seemed to be changing right in front of me. Becoming someone else. How so? He stopped reading, forgot the title of his favorite movie, even his musical taste changed overnight. Right. Once, I said we should visit his brother's grave. And he told me that he'd been an only child. That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something insidious. And not just with Jeff. Notice any changes in yourself. After some time, on several occasions, my friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. That must have been hard. It was. You know, it's at times like those you start to question reality. So the whole time, you knew what I could end up finding. I don't know who, how, or why, but they are changing us. That concealed room in our apartment. What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but must have somehow forgotten. I find that terrifying. Mention any of this to Jeff? I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed, said I was imagining things. He once brought up a vacation that we never went on, swear to God. Maybe you went with someone else. About it in such detail, I almost started believing him. Could be just you who forgot. Maybe they wiped the trip from your memory. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? You haven't told me the whole story yet, have you? I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. 
but I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. So you didn't do anything? I don't remember what happened. I talked to security the next morning. Let me guess. Cams didn't pick anything up. The guy just shrugged and said I must have dreamt it. He showed me the recording, of course. I felt like a lunatic. And then, the next day, I got a call. Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. There was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. They threaten you, try to blackmail you. They said I was walking on thin ice. That if we kept stirring up trouble, Jeff could have an accident then they wiped any record of our conversation it was as if it had never happened so i'm begging you v jefferson can't find out about any of this ever his life depends on it Are you still with this. me? Somebody poking around in your heads? What choice do I have? To get myself killed? Or see my husband dragged away from me? Ask me to lie to my employer. I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. And if I'm not on board? You have a choice. Just remember... Any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Are you truly prepared to mm. fight an SSI after the threats? It'd be brave, but risky as all get out. What they're doing to us is one thing, but when you found that concealed room, I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. What difference does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Hmm. I'll add a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. <laughs> I won't. But that's all I can promise. I do like that this game puts choices in front of you, right? But I'm not sure this is either of these choices are the right choice. memories changing personalities remind you of anything mm -hmm. hey, at least we know what we're up against so in my pants what would you do some real rat bastards behind this someone's got to take them down even by risking the paralysis lives fuck knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull but yeah you could end up putting their lives at risk or not. Tough choice, V. I don't think it is a tough choice. I think we, we find out who's behind it, right? I think we find out who's behind it. Can't have a mayor that's controlled by someone someone else. Do we go see old Jefferson? Why wouldn't there be an EMP grenade just laying around? 1.4k. I've got trauma team right over here. Okay, let's uh, let's get our car and let's read some text messages that we've got. You were sending us lots of messages, right? What what were you saying? Um, apologies are in order. Hey, sorry, sorry, I got you mixed up in all this. Don't worry, guy, you gave me a chance to walk away. I know what I'm signing up for. How do you feel about everything? Maybe I'm starting to feel guilty. It's dumb. 
and forget about the past and move on. Take Claire, you crazy bastard. Okay, what have we got? Net runner, missing net runner. Um, see your job's done comfortably with a crew hand people myself. I choose Chang Hoon Nam. Years ago, he hasn't let me down. Okay. Bugbear. So we did that one. The transport was waiting outside. I get a feeling we're going to stumble into Bugbear, right? Um, steal the shard. And we could buy a car. Okay. There he be. Stop. Oh my god, I almost got hit by my own car. Okay. Let's go let's go meet Jefferson. Let's bring this, this one to a close and see what, what's next on the list of things to do. Well I close for now, you know what I mean. It's fine. It's all fine. Oh God. Jesus, the dude is bad as me. Like it never happened. That makes it interesting, right? Oh, fuck. Johnny? What do you think, Johnny? What do we do now? Hello, V. Hey, ma'am. Need to talk. Yes, I know. Elizabeth filled me in. Sounds like I was right to hire a professional. Elizabeth? What did she tell you exactly? Didn't get specific. Just that SSI was spying for that son of a bitch Holt. Guess you got more, though. SSI wasn't working for Holt. You're in deeper shit than you think. Meaning? In your heads, Jefferson. Yours and Elizabeth's. This some kind of chuckle-worthy metaphor? Strange right dreams, now. partial recall, jumbled memories. It's not just stress and long hours. I don't know what you're trying to tell me, but I don't think I like where this is heading. Wake up. Your brain's a mess. Messier than the discount section of a BD smut hut. I'm not paying you to make up riddles for me, so get to the He's point. got a good point. SSI's on the take for some unknown group that's out to control your lives. Further 
Somebody's hijacked your life, reset your course, your career. I'll admit, there were a couple of fortunate coincidences, but... They forged your views, personality, even that skepticism that pisses me off so much. Clearly what they want is for you to be their mayor. Molding you like a clay figurine. Fuck. I need to remember who recommended SSI to me. Your memories. Can't even trust those anymore. If that's true, I'll never know what's real in my life, and what's a lie, fabricated. Wait, the intruder. I have to find him! I've got no idea how we go about doing that. First I'll find him, then I'll find whoever's behind this. Pull the curtain back on these motherfuckers and show them what's what. Could show their hand if you're patient. Wait long enough. Or use your mayoral powers if you get elected. As long as you don't forget all this by morning. Sun Tzu's art of war. Feign weakness, so your enemy may grow arrogant. I don't see you doing much feigning, Jeff. My god. I have to tell Liz! So what now? You still want to be mayor? Well, I'm not about to give up. I didn't run just to... Uh, I'll wait for my window. An opportunity. Then make my move. Good idea. Not exactly what they want. That was our advice to him. I'll give more than they bargained for. Same to readies. Take care, V. Good luck. And good night. So, thoughts? Hmm, somehow I doubt it's people who were behind this. So aliens? Very funny. <laughs> You're too young to remember this, but not so long ago, people talked about rogue AIs prowling cyberspace. So, not aliens. Doesn't matter who. What matters is that guy decided to take up the gauntlet. My man. Thanks, Johnny. We almost got a look at him, he disappeared. Right, okay. We've got some more missions to do. Um, let's meet up with this, this mysterious uh, client. Why not? Is there a fast travel thing around here somewhere? There's a question mark. I do like the just floating question marks. Okay, have we got uh, we got one over here we could go to, right? It's up top. I don't think we can jump that high. Ow! I thought I was on the path. Apparently not. I mean, it definitely looks like I'm on the path. Run, 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 run. Nice. Let's buy ourselves a burrito to recover. These are cans. Are these all cans? I want to, I want food. What happened over here, boys? Man, these are all cans. Additionally, how do I get up there? This is a bit weird. Okay. Sorry. 
Sorry, sorry. Let's quick travel to our destination, which is over here. The no, no tell motel. Which just obviously reeks of dodgy meetings, right? And other things. Is this where we met old, whatever her name is, the agent? Meredith Stout, or whatever her name was. I feel like it is. All right. Mmm, grape pie. Grape pie, mmm. you wouldn't show shouldn't have to be honest why not normally only work with fixers clients that avoid him tend to be bad news i just care about my privacy everyone wants their privacy maybe but not as much as me why Fuck me it's you do i know you it's me lizzie wizzy Who's Lizzie Wizzy? Sit, please. Let's talk. I don't know who Lizzie Wizzy is. Okay, so what's this about? I think you can guess. I'm in trouble. I genuinely don't know who you are. Mm -hmm. What kind? <laughs> Good question. Been a rough year. Creative block. Can't even say the last time I made anything worth listening to. And to make things worse, I fell in love. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what the hell is happening? Mm. Lizzy like Wizzy must be a singer then, right? Sooner or later, love will only let you down. Guess it'll be sooner. So, we talking a man, a woman? Oh shit, these hands. Sometimes it seems like I just brushed something and sparks fly. <sighs> anyway, a man. His name's Liam. Liam Northam. Been together a few months, but I think he's cheating on me. Okay. Why the suspicion? <sighs> it's so cliched, it's embarrassing. Whispered phone calls in the bathroom, strange receipts, secret meetings in the middle of the night. Any specific event come to mind? <laughs> My mind. That's. That's a touchy subject. Oh, join the gang, love. Why? Don't know each other well enough for that, V. Join the gang. Talk to him at all? Tell him to his face. <laughs> You're adorable. Imagine this. We're never alone. Not really. Always surrounded by assistants, PR reps, makeup artists. I stop smiling at him for one millisecond. It'll be all over every scream sheet in this town. Understood. No, you don't understand. Not until you've lived it. Millions of eyes trained on you constantly. It can be beautiful and terrifying. Yeah, you managed to make it to the no-tell, no-tell motel. Liam Northam. Nah, don't know. Tell me about him. Forty-ish, sensitive, guy who never wanted for anything. You know the type. 
Not really. Heard they exist. How'd you meet? <laughs> He's my manager. I know. I know how it sounds. I never meant to. He's not even my type, but... But? Your body can be chrome, but the heart never changes. It wants what it wants. So what's my role here? What do you want? Proof. And then I'll end things. For good. Liam goes to Riot all the time. I think he meets someone there. I want to know who. You'll find out for me? Can count on me. Perfect. Remember, I want specifics. Details. Recordings or pics if you can. Sure. Keep it in mind. Good. Now go. Alright, Jesus. Well, let's go to Riot in the evening and ask for Liam. Um, and we'll wrap up here. Thank you very much for watching. This is the wrong way. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter. It's got a gaming. I'll see you again soon. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you have been watching Scott Dog Gaming. Don't forget to follow on Twitch and Twitter and head over to YouTube for daily content. See you again soon.